Seemingly in the Netherlands, the pandemic has ended. Finally, there's light at the end of the tunnel. Of course, there are many upsides. More of this, 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 and less of this, this, and this. But there's one big downside. Unsure of what we're talking about? Check out this clip from the Dutch reality show First Dates, pre-pandemic. Hi, Ariel. Do it at It perfectly captures the cultural rift that was dividing the Dutch. Thanks, <laughs> Creating painfully awkward situations countrywide. <laughs> the return of Dutch kissing confusion. Never being certain on exactly how many kisses to give. Now this is strange, because in the lowlands it used to be very, very clear. I've always been told that if you're Dutch, it's three. Traditioneel Nederland, het hoort gewoon met drie kussen. Drie kussen, want dat vind ik gewoon vriendelijk, dat vind ik gezellig. And indeed, it was a certainty in Dutch society. Like Stampot, Roquevorst, Vacations, France. Greeting, three kisses. Left, right, left. For the Dutch, it was their second nature. With a seamless choreography, custom face bending techniques, and overly dramatic sound effects. Even more impressive, the kissing conversation combination. Every Dutchman making the rounds at a birthday, wishing a co-worker the best of Ense, or arriving at Schiphol, knew exactly what to do. Even outsiders got it. Three kisses. The holy trinity of Dutch greetings. Until suddenly, out of nowhere, just one kiss. Nobody quite knows where or why this cultural shift began but it spread like wildfire. For us foreigners attempting to inburger, this all raises a very important question. What the fuck, Holland? The kans van mijn moeders familie geeft altijd drie. Zou mijn kans van mijn vaders familie geeft altijd één. Okay, this is going nowhere. Meet Reinhildus van Ditshuizen, the foremost authority on Dutch customs. She claimed that, contrary to popular belief, kissing three times is actually a recent tradition. I remember quite well when I was young, we in the north kissed two times, twice. And you have the rivers and then it's south, there you kissed people three times. Fifty years ago, in the south of the Netherlands, people would kiss three times. But in the north, only twice. As seen here in this TV show from 1972. And here again, two kisses. But then, Around 1980, that all changed. We had a new Dutch government with many Catholics from the south. In 1977, Brabant-born Dries van Acht became prime minister of the Netherlands and brought a posse of proud fellow southerners with him. They took, of course, their manners from the south to the Hague. So people started kissing three times and then in a rather quick way spread all over the country. All over the country. Could this be true? Could one man be responsible? Could it be the Drie van Dries? Van Acht. Oh. <laughs> ja, dat kan best. Mijn gedrag van drie maal kussen is zo resoluut dat het waarschijnlijk anderen tot orde brengt. En zo, zodra er een vrouwengezicht in de buurt kwam, ging ik drie maal zoenen. Ik was niks anders gewend. Ik heb nogal wat afgezoend en heb nergens spijt van. En like that. The typical Dutch kiss went from two to three. Ik geef je een Nederlandse kus. Until it was everywhere. And everybody lived happily ever after. I never do three times. From the beginning, I refused, you know. I'm from the north and I don't do it. And I, I get annoyed, it's too many. I think one is enough. So where do we go from here? How do you survive future encounters with a local? Well, typically, this lady prefers three kisses. This lady, one. But what about now? Or now? Survival tip. Be direct. The Dutch love that. Tell them, I only do one. Or, we're gonna do three. Tattoo your preference on your face. 
or walk around with a balloon stating your desired number. Alternatively, don't let them get close. Throw a hand, a fist, an elbow, stick and move. <coughs> Cough, cough more, run. And if God forbid none of these solutions work, let's hope and pray the pandemic never ends because life without constant kissing confusion is absolute bliss.